What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony D2Y, checking in once again, man. Today, we got a special video I wanted to put on this channel for you guys, because it has a lot to do with you guys as well. And a lot of my lies I've been telling you for the past two, three years now. But hold on real quick. Let's get straight into this, man. I had to go ahead and get this, because the other one I got is on the verge of death, and it's just time to say goodbye. I mean, I'll probably keep it, and I'm going to use it as much as I can, but it was just time for me to make this next step for this channel, as well as the Tony Two Wild channel, because I will use it for both, and uh, yeah, I'd just rather show you than tell you. Today, guys, I made that big move and got the G7X Mark II Power Shot, the uh, new version. The G7X is one of the best cameras you can get, guys, especially if you're trying to start a YouTube channel, whether it be vlogging, whatever you want to do, vlogging, shoes, whatever. If you have that right budget, that $700 budget, it's, it's the right way to go. That's just me personally. I would say get one of these, and then when you get up there, you can get the DSLRs. I mean, there's tons of DSLRs, but I feel with this price point, this camera is able to give you almost every single option and need that you need when it comes to shooting, guys. Like, I love the G7X, and it's it's the first one did wonders for me. So I had to go ahead and get the Mark II um, and go from there. So let me pull this thing out. Let me go grab my first G7X so we can kind of look and compare. It was sitting here the whole fucking time. That's crazy. All right, so let me see. We got this right here. Let's plug it in. We got a chip in here too, okay? So we got this one. Now this G7X, guys, it's it still works. You know, don't get me wrong. I don't really want to sell it, even though I could make some money, but I, I don't I don't care about the money. It kind of is a more of a uh, sentimental thing. Like this thing has been with me through thick and thin, but the reason why I had to kind of get a new camera is because the lens is slightly scratched and the lens is tending, like the, the camera's trying to focus on the scratch. So sometimes when I'm vlogging, it's not really getting my face. It, it like, be, the, the focus is messing up, you know what I'm saying? So it was just time to get something new and see, and I think it has a lot to do with the way it closes. It gets stuck and I think it's scraping like the lens. I don't know. I've had it for like two, three years now. And it was just, it was just time, man. Like, you know, every, nothing lasts forever, man. So we got here the camera. Let's see, let's see if it uses, uses the same battery. So that's good. Everything is pretty much the same when it comes to that. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in, give you guys like a little quick sample look. And then we could probably even compare the two of them too. So let's just see. All right, guys. So we do got it here. We got both of them right here. So here we go. On the left, you got the... G7X, you could probably see that little light, little bud thing right there, right? That is actually that scratch I was talking about. And then on the right, you got the, the new guy. And wow, it looks so much clearer and crispier. Let's flip the screen on me though. All right guys, so woo, this thing is looking kind of fabulous, fabulous. Okay, let me look. Side by side, you can see, here we go. It's a lot more contrast and the colors are popping way better than that of on the G7X Mark II. So it's definitely a good uh, camera and the focusing is moving way faster that on with the other one. But I think that my G7X Mark II is shooting in 30 and 30 frames rather than and the other one shooting in 60. But overall, it's a really good good update I could, I could definitely tell the difference but yeah guys two of the greatest small cameras ever to hit the market definitely a difference in weight and size and all that i don't want to go too much into a full-on review maybe i can in a different video if you guys would like that but this camera came out like a long time it came out last year you know so i don't want to be like very very late on it but it's way more meteor heavier and the quality is a little bit up to up to date so this is gonna be able to allow me to do more of my vlogging, even though I can tell you that I'm gonna do that and then I don't do that. But like, this looks just as good as this camera at points in time. So just be looking on the lookout and I'm, I'm just, I'm, I, I hope to get more vlogs out to you guys so you guys can enjoy this channel more and I can give you guys more of my time. I love you guys over here at 2 Off TV. You always show love and support, and thank you guys. So just know we got a new camera on the rise. I'm still gonna use the ADD. The ADD was bought for vlogging as well, but it's also done way more than what I thought when it came. It, it does everything. That ADD does everything, but this can get us into secret little places that we're not supposed to be videotaping, and we can do what we gotta do. So huge shout out to Canon for making this right here. <laughs> and I'll make sure to link this down below if you're looking for either this camera or that camera. I will link these down if you're looking into getting a camera for your channel or whatnot. Check it out. Thank you guys for the love and support. Hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. And I'm gonna see you guys on the next video. It's your boy Tony D2Wild. Checking in, checking out.
Peace. Cook up, slanging on the cell phone. Call before you pull up. It's the ice cream man. 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 Master P, we got the hook up. I show you how.